hey y'all welcome back to the channel um i hope y'all doing well today today is wednesday january 6th i believe i know it's wednesday january so <laughs> i'm about to go into the walmart because i heard somebody talking about um this particular store closing when i was in the walmart in my neighborhood but i didn't know where they were talking about and so then my daughter texted me uh last night around 10 something and said hey the bush river walmart is closing so of course i'm over here and my grandson just had a birthday yesterday her son her youngest son so happy birthday to you marshall and today is my other grandson by my son birthday so happy birthday to you dallas um yeah i'm gonna go in this store y'all i don't know if y'all been paying attention to the news but the other night they were talking about what's going on right and so they said in in passing they didn't even stay on the story long or anything they said in passing they said um there's another virus like i know that the virus has mutated and they were having a hard time they're having an extra hard time in california and a lot of things are closing um they're going back to how it was back in march of 2020 so they have one that's 70 percent spread 70 percent faster than the actual original one and now they have another strain of virus another strain of virus that's even worse than that one and this one is coming out of somewhere in africa now they did not stay on the story long and i'm saying to myself so um now is not the time to take your foot off the gas don't pump your brakes go ahead and get what you need now i do intend to do my gardening but in case that does not work out for me if the bugs attack or anything like that and i don't get a production that can sustain us then i need to be able to go into my prepper pantry that has not been raided by my husband my 18 year old son or my 14 year old daughter um and right now that's what's happening in my house so i just did a, a haul video it's not well it'll probably be out before this one i don't know um but anyway in that video i bought another thing of ginger ale y'all why do they want to go through the ginger ale as fast as they going through the ginger ale um i had one upstairs for some reason it's been open and there are drinks missing i don't know if it's just i don't want to go downstairs you know let me just go in this room right here so i'm really thinking about changing the locks i know how to do that i had a property preservation company i'm thinking about putting a lock on that door where they can't just go in it anytime they want and get anything they want i don't have a big stock up i'm just starting the stuff last year and i'm not working so i am on a budget when i do what i do so i don't know why i'm ranting and raving i done did four minutes of ranting and raving y'all i'm not mad about it i'm just like you know why i'm doing this you you're okay with me doing it you want me to do it but then you know they just throw that out the window when that stomach start rumbling or something but uh so y'all thank y'all for joining the channel i'm let me get in this store um if you are new to the channel i promise you i don't rant and rave on here like that um we are doing gardening this year we're doing more canning i started canning last year i have yet to can meat so that's the next adventure for me is to can some meats um what else we're doing over here cleaning videos 
grocery haul videos, um, just hang and chill with me videos, <laughs> exercise videos. We're doing it all over here because I have to stay busy because I'm not working. I need to be home cleaning right now, but I got to go in this Walmart because one, I need to find a gift for the um, grandson whose birthday is today. So I need to do that. And then I'm going to drop these gifts off and then I'm going to go home. No, I got to go for my walk. I got to start doing me. I got to go for my walk and then I'm going to go home. I have to clean. I have to do my son's hair because he's going to wash it and he wants me to twist it for him with these arthritic hands. Um, thank you, son. And I'm just going to go about my day. I got to... Um, water the garden and keep everything moist and juicy so y'all i will talk to y'all in a little bit let's go in the store and see what i can find oh and don't forget to like the video and make sure you subscribe because i would love to have you here well let me not say make sure i would appreciate if y'all would subscribe to the channel help me reach 4k it would be great if I can reach 4k and I think I'll probably do a 4k giveaway when I get there so y'all share me out with your friends and your family and I will see you on the other side don't deny that I could use some comfort Okay, y'all. So I didn't find really any sales in there yet. They haven't marked a lot, if anything, down. There were a few clothing items that were for sale, well, on clearance, um, but nothing that I needed. So I'm only getting the things that I need because, one, I'm on a budget. So this is what I got. I didn't go in here to get any of this. I just wanted to look for another toy for my um, grandson whose birthday is today, like I said. So what I have here, I hope you can hear me because I still have my mask on. Let me pull it down some since I'm at my truck now. I can do that. Okay, so I got me some barbecue skins. And the reason I got these is because this is keto friendly. I'm not on keto, but I am gonna start watching what I eat now I'm still gonna eat and I'm gonna watch it on my plate <laughs> but I'm gonna watch what I eat how much I put in these are like 80 calories and these are really good these are um let me find my receipt which this receipt is kind of faded out um so these right here were 78 cent big bag is like a dollar and 78 cents so it's really reasonable um so I got those and then I got this salad right here. It's $2.94. This is the chef salad. It has like 260 calories in it. And I'll be eating this as soon as I get in the truck. And I'm probably going to record it and add it into this video. I don't know. Or do a separate video. And so I don't get, I don't like to eat their, what kind of, it's creamy ranch dressing. But it doesn't taste like, you know the uh, ranch that I like so creamy dressings aren't really good when you're doing a salad anyway because it's extra extra calories but you got this fat free house Italian right here which is only 15 calories as opposed to adding probably 80 calories from that um, dressing and y'all don't judge me either so these are red hot cinnamon flavored candies it's 60 calories and i was listening to something and they said a good way to get rid of belly fat is to put cinnamon in your water um because cinnamon will help you lose the belly fat so i figured this would help right <laughs> and so 
I got some canned goods right here. They're not all the same. Why are they so loud? This is the part of doing your haul in your car because I don't have time to do it when I get home, y'all. So I apologize. But these are the canned goods that I got. I got three of the tomato and okra because we really love tomato and okra at the house. And how I cook it is I add, um, I fry some um, bacon and I use a little bit of that bacon grease, y'all. I know it's not right, but it's okay. I'm gonna eat this anyway. Anyway, <laughs> so y'all, that's how I cook it. I put a little bit of um, the bacon grease in there and I just cook it like that. And I add a little bit of sugar to it just to knock off the tanginess from the tomatoes. And I eat it with rice. So I got three of those. That's two. Here's the third one right here. And then I got, and oh, they, these were 98 cents. So it wasn't the 50 cent that I was hoping for, but y'all, they're always like 98 cents in there. So that's cheaper than some places. And then I got some golden sweet whole kernel. These were 50 cents. So everything I'm about to show you canned good wise was um, 50 cents. So I got these right here. They say picked and packed the same day how we know that anyway <laughs> it's a 15.25 ounce can um oh these are a 14.5 ounce can but these right here you just put a little salt and pepper in them and um i don't put any sugar in my corn or anything i some people do i don't um i do put a little butter in it though and I got to find some other recipes, especially like for this cream corn. So this was the whole kernel, which my, my daughter them love. I like this one too, but this is my favorite, y'all. I like to eat this right here. Like I will fry up some chicken or some pork chop and I will sop my chicken and pork chop up with this um, creamy style sweet corn. I'm just country like that. This is also a 14.75 ounce can and this was 50 cent. And I, of the corn and the, um, the cream corn and the regular corn. So I got one, two, so I got two of the regular corns and three of the sweet corns of the creamy corn that is. And then I got, um, two cans of the red beans. I have some already at the house because if you haven't seen, I did make a homemade chili um i've done it twice in my life and i just recently did one um in december so go check that video out and let me know if you decide to do it and i'll probably do it again because it's gonna be cold um i'll just time it around the time my husband's gonna come home and i can use my new dutch oven to make it in because i haven't used it yet so over here i got a box of the um, extra big cheeses I normally get the small ones, but I said, well, I'll try the big ones and see if there's a difference in it, if it tastes better, which, I mean, I love the other ones, but I'll try it. Oh, and this was $2 and y'all, um, this is my husband's truck. So you see stuff thrown around. Where's cheese is at on here? Forgive the truck if you see stuff thrown around. They ink is running out, y'all. It's really hard to see this. But they I think it was $2.98. Let me just look for it. Yep, there it is. $2.98. No, that's the um that was the salad that was $2.98. The Cheez Its were $2.88. I apologize, y'all. Um like I said, I got this Italian dressing here y'all know i make my pasta salad with this right here and now i'll be putting this on my salad as opposed to the ranch and i'm a ranch girl i gotta have my hidden valley ranch i just do but that in there is not hidden valley honey it's hidden and it needs to be hidden in the valley so i'm knocking everything over this was either 92 cent or 98 cent okay it was 92 cent the dressing and then 
right here I have let me pull it so you can see it these raisins these are the great value raisins I was really looking for the applesauce but I've never been in this store so I was actually I got tired of walking around trying to find it I'm like where is everything so crazy in here that I see why you're closing so the raisins were one dollar so that's the deal because you get six of these right here and I have some at the house and they haven't expired but these right here are these say August 19th 2021 and we all know just because the date says one thing does not mean that you have to go and throw away food because that is pure waste and we will not be doing that over here on this channel so now I have this was like a Christmas sale um, they were 75% off this is a family size box is 12.2 ounces I've never tried the cereal before I haven't eaten cereal lately because milk has not been my friend I've dropped down from whole milk to 2% to 1% and skim doesn't do me that bad but it's like I mean really is healthier for you the skim milk so I'll probably try this right here once I get some skim milk because right now I think all I have is the um, whole milk I got from Sam's Club so shelf no elf on the shelf this flavor is a sugar cookie cereal with marshmallow flavor now y'all sugar cookie cereal hmm sugar cookie I'm trying to imagine what that would taste like they also had a candy cane flavored cereal of this and I said I don't know how I like candy canes but I don't know how good that would be in some milk but I know sugar cookie milk all of that sounds good tastes good together so we got that and it's like 150 calories um I think the kids would like it I paid a dollar and fifty for these and honey, I made sure it rang up for a dollar fifty because I had gotten something from the lawn and garden. It was um, like a hand rake, and it was marked down sixty cents. And so I said, "Okay, I'm going to get that," even though I just bought one. And then I rung it up, and it said ninety four cents. Well, I know ninety four cents is not a lot of money, but it is when you're not working, and I'm not working, and that's not a food item. So, you know. Oh, they doing a little step show over there, y'all. Let me see if y'all can see it trying to raise money all right now there you go now so every time you donate they do a little step i love it support your black colleges support colleges period but especially the black colleges they need your help okay back to the hall so i got this ginger rail right here Canada Dry. I don't really drink Canada Dry unless somebody else buys it. I will not buy it with my money. But I don't know if this was like one of the specials because of Christmas, but it's the Cranberry Ginger Ale. Let me zoom in. It's the Cranberry Ginger Ale and it is two liters. And so I said, well, let me try it. And that was, um, That was a dollar and 25 cents. And then I got these candy canes that you see here. It's 12 in a box. They're not crunched up. They're all whole. And that's surprising because they've been shifting around. And these say 50 calories. You know, you I take these and I I'm not getting these just to, you know, get them for Christmas this year. I can take these and break off of these for a while because I like to put my mints in my water. So I'm going to start doing my waters again with mint and then I'll chop up some um, cucumbers and I'm going to buy a special container this time that way I can just make it at one go and then every time I'll just put, you know, it in my water and it satis satisfies me. It cuts my cravings a lot and, you know, I'm a stress eater. I'm an any kind of eater. So 
someone in my comments, I can't remember who it was, but thank you because I never think to look over there for this type of bread. So this is a French bread and it cost, it's a 14, it's 14 ounce of bread. Yeah, French bread baked in the store, 14 ounce, and this was $1. And I did not think fresh bread for a dollar because had I thought about it yesterday when I did my Walmart haul, I would have gotten this instead of that, you know, that bread, the great value bread in the blue bag is like um, 88 cent. I don't like that bread because I usually do Nature Valley, but I did Nature Valley yesterday, but I also got like two of those just to put in the freezer for a throwback. So if they run out and I can't get to the store, they can pop that out and eat it. But this right here, I may do this like that now instead of buying the 88 cent bread for a few cents more and just get some fresh bread, y'all. You can't beat that. I've been looking at videos, so I'm gonna end my video, but. I'm gonna end it by saying I've been looking watching videos and I'm trying to learn how to make bread and I made some biscuits already but um, I was trying to make like my biscuits rise and be higher and I don't know if I was using the wrong um, flour I was using all-purpose but my husband's like maybe you need to use self rising or something so I went to the store and I found um, some bread it was actually biscuit um, flour and you don't have to add you know all the ingredients all you got to add is the buttermilk so I'll be making that um, video soon and I hope y'all stay tuned for that so make sure you like the video if you don't like the video then hit the down button it lets me know either way um, just you know as someone I've been watching lately would say just don't give me the middle finger. Give me the thumbs up, give me the thumbs down, but never the middle finger. So, thank y'all for supporting this channel. I appreciate y'all. Um, if you're new here, I appreciate you for coming over wherever you came from. I appreciate it. It means a lot because I think my husband looks at me some time ago, what are you doing? I mean, he knows what I'm doing, but why are you doing it on YouTube? So, Y'all take care. Oh, did I do the Gatorade? Well, I'm about to drink that. That was like a dollar. Zero sugar. And these are good. My doctor told me when I had um, COVID, he said, well, she said, it was the nurse, really. She was telling me all the things I need to do. And they said that this would be great, not just for, well, kind of like for dehydration, of course, but it would just be great to have this kind as opposed to the other kind with all the sugars in it. And this is zero sugars. So y'all take care. Remember that I love you, but God loves you more. He created only one you. So please be the best you that you can be. And when you're that person, go out and spread God's love. With distance, of course. And until next time, y'all. I know I got a bag to put the gifts in. And this is like, let me show you the gifts I got. I'm supposed to be closing out. So, I got this gift right here from Target, Target. I got this gift for my daughter's son, because they love little stuff like that. So cute. I'm about to drop that off to him. And that's it for my haul, y'all. Again, I appreciate you. And if you haven't subscribed, please join the family. If you haven't already, thumbs the video up. Thumbs it up. If you haven't shared it out, please share me out. Thank you. Love y'all so much. Bye.